Wanted to talk a little bit about Ken and uh, his return to Iowa. Uh, needless to say, you know, we're all really thrilled about it. Just uh, really glad that he was uh, interested in the position and uh, most importantly accepted it. You know, right, right from the start, I uh, think like everybody uh, that knows follows Iowa football. You know, Ken's just an outstanding person. So that, that's a real plus for us. You know, beyond that, uh, his depth of experience, his wealth of experience, uh, not only you know, in terms of the positions that he's held, but also uh, the various levels he's coached at. Uh, to me, that's just really uh, attractive and beneficial. And you know, it leads into the next point. To me, he's just going to be an outstanding resource for everybody on our staff. Uh, myself, uh, he, was, he was a guy I leaned the hardest on uh, 18 years ago. He had extensive head coaching experience uh, when we came here. And uh, so I was leaning on him hard. But I think now just everybody on our staff is going to have a chance to really benefit from his wealth of experience. Um, you know, on every level. So really happy about that. And then really what it gets down to, you know, he's just uh, not only an outstanding person, but he's a tremendous teacher, a tremendous coach. Um, and he's got demonstrated success, certainly, at the, the task that, uh, that he's accepted, and that's coaching our quarterbacks. And you, know, you go back historically, you look at uh, the work that he did with our first-year players at the position. You know, I think that speaks for itself. And probably, probably the most important thing I can say, you know, since uh, the announcement's uh, been made, uh, the, the feedback that we've gotten from former players, and a lot of it's been public, whether it's Brad Banks, uh, Drew Tate, Mar McNutt, Ed Henkel, you know, guys that have, uh, you know, were proven players here. And, and I think one thing to, to add to that, uh, you know, it's interesting that players, after they, you know, get uh, removed from their careers, especially, you know, they're eight, 10 years removed, 12 years removed, and start having families, adult lives, all that type of thing. To me, those words that, uh, that they say mean even more because they really, I think, value and appreciate. Uh, their experience at Iowa a little bit differently when you get into your 30s.